Does anyone eat the candy canes like this side first? If so, they're monsters. <laughs> So candy canes are one of the most beloved Christmas treats. They've been around for a couple of hundred years, and typically they come in the classic peppermint red and white stripes. But they actually go far beyond that into some pretty weird flavors. We're gonna give some of them a try. First, we've got these coffee-flavored candy canes. Some of these are broken, typical candy cane problem. This one is pretty good. Mostly tastes like sugar. It's a little hint of coffee and kind of a little hint of like Tootsie Roll flavor to it. Next up, we've got Oreo. It tastes like chocolate icing. Oh wow, so I suspect my tongue is black. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I would worry about giving these to children. Clearly they will stain everything you own. Another good take on some sweet flavored candy canes. We've got root beer, orange crush, and Dr. Pepper. So I'm gonna try root beer because that's my favorite. Strong root beer flavor right off the bat. Kind of an old fashioned candy flavor to them. I think they're great. Okay, now we're getting into the ones that are a little scary. First, we're gonna try these bacon candy canes. Mm. It has this sweet and smoky flavor to it, and yet there's a smack of ham to it. It has a bad aftertaste though. It really lingers. Pickle next. Mm. I know this is gonna sound weird, but it has a kind of dill meets peppermint flavor, and not necessarily in a bad way. Rotisserie chicken candy canes here. Mm. Oh, it smells like canned chicken. <laughs> oh. Oh, that was so bad. <laughs> it's real bad, you guys, it's so bad. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take more licks of it because I hate myself. <laughs> oh, it is really gross. Last but not least, the mac and cheese candy canes. Mm. Okay. That smells like uh, dirty laundry. <laughs> and I mean, sometimes cheese smells like that, to be fair. Hmm. It just tastes wrong. It's like that, that sprinkle Parmesan cheese you get in a can with sugar. The smell is really more problematic, to be honest. Whenever it gets close to your mouth. You smell it before you taste it. Oh, it smells really bad. It's unavoidable. If you were to leave these out for Santa instead of cookies, he would probably burn your house to the ground. <laughs> I'm Maura Judkis, a reporter for the Washington Post, and happy holidays.